what's happening, Captain of this year, boy, CB Hunters? And yes, we have it for you. It's the Mattel's Masters of the Universe Revelations. Andra. Man, I've been waiting trying to find this bad girl for the longest, but I couldn't find it. But I had a special help for a homeboy, Jesus Garza. He went up to my uh, target early, saw it, said, hey, fam, do you need this? I said, yes, sir. He said, all right, fam, I got you. So, well, for him, I wouldn't have this. So, I just want to say, well, thank you, homie. But, man, I like how this uh, package looks. It's almost like a little lunch bag. It's almost in the way how it looked in old school like back in the day. But you see the type of packaging it got, all black. You see the little designs up top. You got the National Universe Revelations um, show logo, names, you know, all the figure what it comes with. Side of the box, got a, got a name right there. This side of the box has a nice picture artwork of her, of her like wearing a mask. And on the back of the box, got a full picture of her without the mask, showing how she's weapon and everybody in this wave here. And she also has a volume on the back of the box. So if you want to read it, pause it. There it goes. And trust me, once we get this bag out the box, we, we will see what to do with the Andre. Now we back and got this bag out the box. Man, I was sitting there just, just kind of like, Fooling with this figure for a little bit, yeah, I can tell she, she gonna be like, 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 like my f f f favorite out of all of them. You ain't lying. Cause the way how they got her and the stuff they, the all the stuff she just came with, man, this is gonna be off the chain. But before we can talk about the figure, we gonna talk about everything she comes with. She comes with uh, three pairs of hands, two fists that she already got on her. Uh, this is my hands where she can hold uh, a, a actual actual weapon, but she don't got anything to, to, to hold at all though. But she do, does have this. And last pair she has is the hand that's more of like an open palm. So that's those there. And with her, she has her 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 um blaster on the wrist that has a hole and you can add this piece onto it so it shows like a more way blast effect I don't really like how this one looks I hope I can find one that's, that's like that's like a little bit better than this one I don't like how, the, how, the, how this one looks but hey this is hers and so Another thing she comes with is an extra head scope, but as a helmet. I like the way this helmet looks. It's kind of like, 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 uh, and it's seen like a little air piece going around the neck. It, it, you, you, you would think this would hold back articulation, but it actually, oh. but. Does really lose articulation with, with this hole right there, so really good with that. And I like the eyes as well, and look look badass with the, with her cloak over it. So just when I take the pictures, I will be take pictures of all that as well. Next up, we're gonna talk about the main girl herself, Andra. I like her cloak that she has. It's more of like a soft material. It's more like a soft velvet. So when you do put these little straps behind, it does hold in place real well because the Velcro does stick. And you can easily put the cloak in front of her like that. Well, I did it earlier. It did, it did hold. There it goes. So it does hold. So I kind of like how the ad is, so I can take pictures of it. And, uh, I don't got to worry about it, it trying to like, come loose or anything. So I do like that. So, but to get more better with the the actual figure, we're gonna we're gonna 
take this off. And I'll show you the cloak a little bit more up front. Right. And like I was saying, with the cloak, you see you got the hood up there, and you got these pieces that go around the neck. When it goes, it sticks to the piece in the back. So it, it like it holds it, it holds everything in place. So that you gotta worry about it uh, falling off her or not. So, do you know if you've seen the show, you have it, spoiler alert, spoiler alert, she only has it on at the, I think the, the first episode does that she's in. After that, she takes it off and do the rest of the show, she doesn't, she doesn't have it on after that. So, this is how she looks without it. I like the way the figure looks, I like the, the actual face sculpt over her. She doesn't look, look exactly like the cartoon as much. But you know, they have a hard time making the image look like them. I don't think all of them don't really look like the actual figure the cartoon as much, but, it, but, it, but it's still kind of close. I like the hand, I like, I like the braids, how they got it. Like, we got the little piece of the back. Now, I must say, over Hasbro, at least Mattel knows how to do. Uh, uh, Alright, people, hair. I'll say that. I like the way the, the suit looks on her. It doesn't like the uh, doesn't show. I like call it looking clean. Got a vest going over her shirt. Some back. Got a big handle there going around her. Got a belt is and the belt is like free, free moving. So it does move up and down. Got her, got her tall boots on. Got the little design of the buckle and the knee pads. Basically, right there. This figure here, like I like how it looks. The whole the whole design on it, and and you gotta love is like is is like also pinless. You got no pins in the knees, no pins in the elbows, and double elbows as, as well. So I cannot wait to take pictures of these. With the articulation that she has. And speaking of articulation, with Andre, we're gonna start with start with that. So with Andre, she looks back that far, looks forward that much. Got a little head tilt, raise her arms up about that much. Bicep swivel, double elbows. Does has real good range. Get that other side up. There it goes. Got good range with the elbows, ends of the wrist, turn around. Not a much ab crunch, just, just a little bit there. Going back, waist twist, the splits that much, forward that much, back, not as much. It's a little because it looks kind of weird when you try to get back. She has double knees that far Get back that much Get forward a little she does have ankle rockers all all like I said I like this figure I like the way it looks I can't wait to take some pictures with her and now we come part of you we see our other uh, National Universe Revelation uh, figures looks next to Andre. First is a uh, stacks of it's two the Master of the Universe of Revelations Savage He Man. I did a review of this two pack and I shared I shared my opinions on this figure. If you want to go check those out or we'll watch the video, I will leave links down below to, to that video there. You can tell by the tone of my voice. Wasn't too happy. Wasn't too happy. But like I said, you want this you want to choose see what I said about it. Click that link. Fam. Click that link. And up next is I stack up next to the Master Universe Revelations Evil Limb. I really do like this figure. Just like just as much as Andra. Uh got a little more bit 
articulation than the other ones. So I can't wait for other figures to come out. Especially can't wait for that uh, King. Uh, what's the name? King Grace Gold to come out. And I can't wait to find that Urge uh, Strap Jaw as well. The one figure that I want them to make. Hopefully to make the, him the right size though. And since he's going to be a little bit shorter. Don't really, like, really give him his full articulation. And the type of hand he needs to hold that sword. You already know what I'm talking about. Is 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 a, it's Adam. Prince Adam was a more smaller person. And it's it's you know short as well. About the same height as um as Tila. It wasn't too short, but he was a little bit taller. So I don't know if they're gonna have it the same height as her in the toy line. The same thing it is in the show. Don't know. Hopefully. And last but not least, this is next to the Master Universe Revelations. Tila. I missed the outfit whenever she left the, left the palace and went on her own. Because we all know what happened. In this case, some people haven't seen. We're going to see that first. You can find out what happened. Well, why she leave, but them two are, are, are artists in crime on the show after that. And speaking of the sh show, I wouldn't uh, not the show, but the actual figures that I want to have. I can't wait for the release of the uh, other Tila in her uh, original outfit. So I, I definitely will be picking her up. I got her on pre order on Big Bad Toy Store. Hopefully they'll like come through on time. So we shall see. We shall see. And this is my review of the Tales Master Universe Revelations on you. Hope y'all enjoyed this review. Trust me, you go ahead and find time making it. And you know with every review, I will take pictures. This is my Instagram right here, but I will leave links down below if you want to check those out. And the boys on TikTok. I'll take those same pictures, post over there, I'll just add a little bit of flip. This is your boy CD Hunts. Hope you have a blessed one. Trust me. I can let you in that next one.